Yeah, it is weapons. Well, I'll upgrade weapons. It's less than a hundred bucks a pop on almost all of them. Um, two turns for a thing of triremes. Yeah, yeah, I'll I'll pay that. And now we can uh, see. Well, we could see it before, but now we've got a army close to this area here. We could go for the mausoleum at Halicarnassus, but that one that's not really all that big of a deal right now because if we did that if we advanced onto Asia Minor I would be willing to bet almost anything that the Seleucids would then be like yeah we're attacking right now right fucking now and I can see why they would really now you I've got a feeling That if you attack me, you're going to try and be clever and do it at night. So we've got a couple of options. We can, we can withdraw from the siege. And attack these guys and hope that draws this garrison out. We can wait and see what he does. Does he have night fighter? He might not. But I think this guy probably does. Yeah, if he's got five command stars, I'd be willing to bank on him having it. He's the faction heir as well. You, I don't think, will attack. Sir. Yeah, I don't think that guy will attack me. I think if I get attacked in the general area, it'll be here. So... I'm going to preempt them if I can. Can I attack him? How long would it have been? It would have been eight turns anyway, but so yes. I'm willing to assault. Okay. Now we can have a good look at what we're fighting. Oh, it's the faction leader as well. Avatar of the gods. Wow. There you go. Clean hands. Makes sense, I suppose. He's a decent fighter. But he doesn't have Night Fighter. And I'm pretty sure he was the one in the city. Yeah. You've got Night Fighter, don't you? Yep. What about you? No. No, you didn't. But the man who mattered, the guy who was hanging out outside with the actual army, did. So I could, yeah, I'm not going to fight just the guys outside the city. I want to take the damn city, so let's have at it. They have artillery. We're going to have to fight it. It's going to hurt. But if we can completely and utterly destroy them, we should be able to just walk into the city. And so it begins! We Romans never seek war, but having come to battle, we will not leave until it is over. That's actually true. We haven't started any of the wars against Carthage, I don't think. The They've started they think them all. They are our equals, Unlike in history. Our enemies. I think they are waiting to die. They have been brought to the battlefield by mewling infants instead of leaders. Meow. We are even matched in numbers, man for man. But that does not tell the whole story. No, it does not. All that said, we are the stronger. Every one of you is better than they. Remember this and take heart from the memory. The enemy will undoubtedly try to slaughter us at a distance. We must charge home and stop their cowardly plan. Many times I have faced this enemy and many times I have beaten them. Today, when we win, this victory will be yours as much as mine. Hooray! Now, battles are only drilled <laughs> with some blood splashed around. March forwards, and the enemy will quiet. Hooray! And remember this above all. Our Roman gods are watching. Make sure they are not ashamed. Indeed, for Jupiter and Mars. Okay, 
So what do we got? What do we have on the table? I should have probably looked at that before I went, yeah, let's do this. This will be a great idea. But no, no, we've got a, got a solid core. Oh, I remember now. You were the guys who fought against that army earlier. And instead of the units continuing to rout, they decided, nope, nope, we were just kidding. And then they came back. And then they ran away. And then they came back. And then they ran away. But then they came back. Bastards. So, um, we haven't really got... A missile troop contingent, which is irritating, but we have got some skirmishers, so we'll send them to the front and hope that they can draw some of the missile fire away from our very, very valuable troops, the infantry. Uh, this Gallic light cab, it's useless, we'll just keep it here. To chase down stragglers, I suppose. I think we have the cavalry advantage. I'm pretty sure we do, but uh, let's see. The enemy have brought up more men. Okay, so there's an army coming in on our flank. Actually, they're pincering us. Clever. Okay. In that case, what we're going to do... So we're going to advance like this and place ourselves right in the middle of all of them. We're basically going to swing these wings in and form something of a box to defend our position from. This guy, don't need to worry about him. He's got no troops to make a difference. These guys in there. This unit of crappy cav in there. And the Iberians over here. Okay. I'm going to split you guys off from the main group. Line up like so. Line up like so. Cavalry. Go get their bloody artillery. If they lose their artillery advantage, we've got them pretty much no question. But while they have that artillery, they have a significant advantage over us. So, we must neutralize it. Fortunately, everything except the artillery moves very quickly. So, if we're lucky, we'll be able to manage to get behind them. If they send their general cab back to try and stop us, that might not be the worst thing in the world. Now you, go and annoy them. Actually, I want to hold off on throwing the pillar. Just for now. Okay, charge. Come on, don't do stupid shit. Alright, they're firing. They are killing. But we should have them because of how close we are. Get him. Sploosh. Okay, now, kill them. Kill this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Artillery needs to be mobile. Uh, not artillery, cavalry. Cavalry needs to be mobile. Get out of there. Get out of there. Go, 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 go. They're running. They're no longer a threat. Get out of here. Okay, the cavalry is coming back to face us. Oh, come on, run! Alright, there we go. You, keep going. 
You, turn him back. Counter charge. Bang. Shaken, wavering, come on, break. Break, so we can face the General Cab by ourselves. Come on, yes. All right, go, get him. Oh, that's not General Cab, that's Numidians. Aha! Get him. Come on. No, no, get him. Get him, get him, get him. I thought it was General Cav. It's not. It's better. Okay. That's good. That's very good. Gotcha. Alright. Let's see how the infantry is doing. We're waiting, basically. Launch pillar. Launch pillar. Yeah, our skirmishers are buggered, but that's alright. They were not expected to survive. Turn. And cavalry. Begin marching in behind this general. I want to smack him. I want to smack him very, very hard. If we can. You need to go. Alright, there we go. They are running, no longer a threat. Get back in position. Their cavalry, their general cav, might come for ours. We will wait. We will wait for a moment. Triarii? Kill those sons of bitches. Alright. You charge in the flank. We need to break him quickly. We outnumber him. We could probably charge him head on and win. I don't like doing that. Hell with it. If we don't make a move, he's going to get his reinforcements towards us in the form of these guys. So, fuck him. Charge. Toot. Bang. Oh, that was beautiful. That was beautiful. I love this game! That was amazing! Alright. Do you have artillery? Was it just that one guy had artillery? I honestly cannot remember. I know all of you guys need to shoot. The enemy general flees! Press forward so the spirit of his army is broken too! It's not this guy, is it? No, can't be. The other guy? Hang on, wait, what? No. You didn't, did you? Holy shit. You did. Oh, he's gonna get away. God oh, damn it. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. You win some, you lose some. Kill the other general. And now his men fear us. So there's that. It's time to press the attack. Now we just need to charge these guys in the rear. And then hopefully they'll run. Broken. And running. Come on, get him. Get him, get him, get him. There we go. Flight. Pursue them and drive them from the battlefield. Perfect. All right, you need to get over here, Triarii and Stardi. Need you back. All right, turn. 
like that. Are you running? You might be running. You probably are running, aren't you, you bastard? Right, give chase. Oh shit, no, that's not what I want to do. God damn it. Pause, 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 pause. Erg. Alright, cavalry chase, cavalry chase, and other unit of cavalry chase. That's, yeah. That's what I meant to do. You, who I want to stay here. Alright, go, 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 go. Run as fast as you can. And same with you. Go. If we're lucky, we can make him turn around and fight us, but I don't think he is going to. I think he's just going to go and try and run. Yeah. The gods be praised! The enemy's hearts are full of fear, and now they flee! Damn it. Well, it's worth a go. We should see if we can kill a few of their guys before they get away. Particularly the artillery. We can kill the artillery. I'll consider that job well done. Alright, go, 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 go. I'm not quite sure why the artillery is still continuing to advance, though. I would have thought that would be, like, one of the first things to turn around and run. Because of how close it is to the edge of the map. But, apparently, I was wrong. Not that I'm unhappy about this. Y yeah, y this is a bad idea for you guys. Really. I'm, I'm, I'm just... I've got your best interests at heart. So it's not a clever move. Okay then. The enemy army is in flight. Pursue them and drive them from the battle. Chase them down. Yeah, they're probably going to get away. But that's all right. I do not mind. Not really. And what are they going to do? Okay. Well, we lost less than 200 men, and we killed over a thousand of theirs. This fella is a problem, though, because he got away. But, on the other hand, we might be able to slip a spy in there and open the gates. Let's try. 57%. Okay, he's got a 24% chance to open it. We've got the faction leader and faction heir in there. Ah. I've got artillery, though. I don't like it when they have artillery. I do not, I do not, I do not. Try that. <laughs> Damn. Well, it was worth a go. You need to get over here, Mr. Rex. Yeah, you're not a very good spy either. So, we'll just have to do an immediate spy. Damn, 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 damn. What have we got in here? I'm sort of willing to assault this, but I know that if I do... I'll stop being able to build Primarian units. And right now, with the Seleucid Empire just sitting there waiting to attack me, I don't know if I can afford to do that. Hmm. It would free up an army. But that's just about the only positive I could see from doing it. 
because we'd still have to leave troops as a garrison force. Even if we took these places. General. But seeing as we've got a second, please go away. You are useless. I'll keep the 30 Velites. They might still be useful. General. Hmm. General. Well... A lot of these units are fairly full. Sir. So I think it'd probably be worth it. Prepare for battle. Besieging settlement, sir. Settlement under siege, sir. But I don't want to fight on these epic stone walls. Or even the large stone walls for that matter. Rhodes just had regular stone walls, didn't it? So look. Yeah. I'm going to need to think about it. Hmm. So I'm going to end this video set here. And next time I'll have come to a decision. And hopefully the Seleucids won't attack us. Because that would be terrible. And hopefully the game continues to behave. So until next time. Thank you for watching. And Grey Hunter signing out.